Uh, hi everyone, happy Tuesday. Welcome back to my channel. I did not vlog yesterday because this is what I have been like the last two days. It has been so hectic. Right now I am making dinner. It is 5.50 p.m. I'm just making like a simple uh, sirloin steak and I'm gonna boil up some Trader Joe's raviolis. Yesterday was crazy. It was a hectic Monday. I was also kind of cranky and I just didn't have a chance to pick up the camera at all. But really all you missed is I did some work in the morning on my computer and then Zane ended up having to film a YouTube video and I had a meeting, like a Google meeting with my YouTube partner manager. So I like got ready so fast and I ran over to my parents' house and they weren't even home so I had to like sneak into their house. <laughs> and I took my meeting there, so that was hectic and fun. And then I ran off to Zumba, and then right after that, we went bowling. If you remember, for Mother's Day, we got, it was like part of Zane's mom's gift. Sorry, Benji's drinking out of the sink if you hear the water running. For Mother's Day, we got Zane's mom bowling, like for the whole family, and it was about to expire on June 30th. So we finally went ahead and did that, and then we went and got kava for dinner, and then we came home and went to sleep. So that was my day yesterday, and then today, I did the podcast and sat on my computer all day doing work. So you didn't miss much. <laughs> Here we are. Let me wash my hands. Also, you guys saw in my last vlog me set up my roses on the counter. Bad idea. Uh, Benji knocked them down, so to add to my already busy and frustrating Monday. He knocked those over, so we had to clean that up. It was just a very hectic day. Now we put them in like a vase that's like short and wide so he can't actually knock it over, which is what I should have done from the beginning, but you live and you learn. I don't really have fresh flowers often, so I didn't really think that far into it. Grocery list, onion powder. Also update on gotta be good. I think I'm making strides in the uh, monetization process. So expect a new recipe. I don't wanna give a date, but I wanna put one up soon. I'm hoping by the time you're seeing this that we've got it all sorted out. But thank you guys for your patience. I know there's a lot of recipes on there already, so it's not like super duper rush, but I am excited to, you know, develop more new things. So that's that. I'm starting to get my motivation back because I was kind of upset for a while, not gonna lie, rightfully so. That's a lot of effort, oops. I'm using my new caraway pot and pans. Pot and pan? This one is ready for the steak, so I'm gonna put those in. So that's really it, you guys. I just wanted to kind of start the vlog and like, you know, start chatting with you for the week. Uh, I don't even know if I'm gonna pick up the camera for the rest of the night. Honestly, I'm gonna eat this dinner, go to Zumba, come home, shower, and then get some more computer work done. I have so many TikToks and Reels that I want to like edit up and just get on drafts so that I'm not, they're not in the back of my mind like I always have something to do. I wanna like just get them all edited and ready to go. Also, Zane and I decided that we're gonna go to the beach tomorrow morning for at least two hours. Just enjoy, I've been wanting to go to the beach. Tomorrow's gonna be gorgeous. And I need to just carve out time and do it because my balance is like very like this. So we're kind we're kind of like trying to like recalibrate that. You know what I mean? We're getting it together. I'm excited. <laughs> not this appearance though is not together at all. I'm just gonna quickly throw together like a little side salad for dinner because we have some stuff that's gonna go bad. This arugula is already sad, but I'm gonna pull what I can so we don't waste. some tomato, I'm also gonna do some shallot, some almonds, crispy onions, there's not much left, so we're just gonna dump it on there, and some croutons, I'm just gonna crush them up a little bit. And then lastly, I just have some shredded Gruyere cheese, put some of that in there. I'm very impatient with these raviolis, so they're going in now. <laughs> All right, nothing crazy fancy, but here's dinner. <laughs> I took a little bit off of Zane's steak because I didn't cut them evenly, you know what I mean? <laughs> just made a little side salad, put whatever dressing we want, and then I just tossed the raviolis with just some butter and salt. Very simple because these are flavorful and yummy. And that's our quick dinner. I'm so hungry right now. I had a giant yogurt bowl this morning, but I'm so excited to eat. Delicious. We love a well-balanced dinner. Zane and I always joke, these are like our favorite dinners when we have like a meat, a salad slash veggie, and then like a carb. Feels balanced. <laughs> so I went to sleep before Zane got home from tennis, so I left him a little note, and I woke up to a reply. That's adorable. Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday. It is 8.29 a.m. I rolled out of bed. My eyes are usually open around 8 o'clock, 
and I decided to just get ready for the beach real quick. I just did a little bit of SPF tinted moisturizer so my face doesn't burn. Tiny bit of mascara and then I put on, oh I did a little bit of my brows too, like two swipes. And then I put on this road peptide lip treatment. It's in the scent watermelon so I thought it would be like beachy vibes and it smells delicious and my lips are nice and moisturized and my hair is dirty so i waited to wash it until after the beach so i just threw it up in a braid if i could do a french braid i would but i can't maybe if i learned and tried but today's not that day i'll show you my bathing suit and my cover up in a little bit but we have a few things to go through real quick we're not leaving until about 10 so i wanted to get up and get a few things done before we go first of all let's do our gratefuls together do you guys write down three gratefuls every morning you should be because it starts the day off good and it makes you think about things that you're grateful for. My number one today is beach day because I've been wanting to go to the beach. So I'm so happy that I'm actually doing it. When we were recording the podcast yesterday, I was like kind of just venting about balance in my life and how I'm having a hard time finding it. And Zane's mom was like, you're going to the beach tomorrow. I was like, okay, I'm going to the beach tomorrow. Just do it. I'm like, I'm gonna just do it. And I'm excited. And it's the perfect day because I need to redo my tanner. It's like alligator. And tomorrow we're doing a photo shoot with Monica. She asked Zane and I to model for like an idea that she had. And I was like, absolutely. So I need to redo my tan fresh for the photo shoot. So today I'm not gonna care. I'm gonna lather on my sunscreen and I'm gonna bake in the sun and I don't care if my tanner comes off my body. I am grateful for you guys, my followers, subscribers followers um yesterday i posted my boston vlog and you guys were just really sweet last one i'm gonna put that i'm grateful for my car because yesterday what happened i was going to zumba and i was just like oh, i just hop in my car and drive and my car is so nice and comfortable i love her those are my gratefuls for today comment down below what are your three gratefuls okay make sure you put it and start writing them every day zane and i have done it for every single day for the whole entire year it's been very fun it was one of my new year's goals and i'm so happy that we're doing it i think i should get a light after all that hold on hello okay let there be light very exciting package my transitional glasses came i just got the same ones that i always wear if you guys remember i went in the city to warby parker and got them i got the same ones they just changed to a sunglass lens in the light which is so fun and i've been wanting them for so long so let's see the true unboxing oh they came in a nice little case i should keep them in this case i'm the worst so they look exactly like the ones that I wear. It's just if I go out in the sun, they turn into a sun glass. And they're my new prescription. Whoa, this feels too strong. Uh-oh, but like maybe that's a good thing because I need to see. I'm like reading the paper from far away. I mean, the person that helped me, I gave them my prescription paper. So they just like took that info and plugged it in. So I don't think they messed up on that end unless they just like read the handwriting wrong. But it's very strong. I think it's good. I think it's just gonna take some getting used to it. And I'm also staring at this light, which is like not helping. But let's step outside and see if they turn into a sunglass. Oh, they're going. I got like a brown lens. It was like black, brown, or green. Matches my bathing suit. Oh, wow. It did work. I'm not like directly in the sun either. So I'm sure they'll be like stronger. I just got the same like frame in hopes that it would look cute as a sunglass. But I think that it's okay, right? Guys, this is magical right now. I can see clearly, but I also don't have sun in my eyes. This is amazing. I think I just have to get used to the strength because it's a stronger prescription. I also have astigmatism that's new. So I have to get used to like the new lenses. Other than that, I think we're good. It's gorgeous outside, wow. Let me actually might as well show you my outfit of the day now while we're outside real quick this cover-up is from cup she this bathing suit is from amazon i was feeling quite bloated but i was like you know what who cares Alyssa? wear your bathing suit so i'm wearing it anyway it's a little more um mid-rise for my liking i like high rise but we're going uncomfortable i'm definitely sucking in right now <laughs> let it go let it go it's okay this is what a real body looks like we're bloated we have a uterus all as well it's really cute though it's brown and then it's got like these gold rings there's also one over here and i'll probably just wear like little slides right now i'm wearing crocs which is not happening <laughs> but yeah that's the vibe i haven't worn it yet so i'm excited and i've got glasses on her sunglasses and i can see it everything's so great oh so happy now we're back inside let's see them transition back the in-between is very funny like this is very funny looking. They're going back slowly but surely, question mark. They're left at like this in between. Oh, they're, got, they're getting there. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this with me today. I have so many of these and I don't use them. Okay. All right, they kind of went back. They go back very slowly, but I'm gonna take these off for now. I don't wanna get a headache. I have to be careful because 
they're very strong but i will be wearing those at the beach today very excited i can drive when it's sunny and i'll still be able to see um i got a package from versed which i love their glow drops they're so fun i put them under my makeup and they just give me like a nice glow their stuff is sold at target too oh let me put my light back on let's see what they sent wake up i'm already up what do you think about that? Okay, you can't fit everywhere, so you need to excuse yourself. Go on this chair. Thank you. Thank you, Verse, for sending some stuff over. Let's see. Oh, I'm excited. We've got their moisturizer, which I'm just running out of. It's great. Glow drops. Oh, and this is a different um, shade. So they have two different shades of it. So I have the darker one. So I'm excited to try this one too. This will probably be cute for like highlighter kind of vibes or like putting it on your collarbones too. Yes. We've got a brightening serum, we've got a cleansing balm, and we've got a milky cleanser. I could put this in the shower to clean my face. Well, thank you so much, Burst. I'm so excited. Love your stuff. Fun, fun. I also got this month's newly order. It's the clothing rental service that I use. So I'm so excited because last month it was so fun to like wear stuff to certain events and then like post pictures in it all. It was really, really fun. Um, but I want to like try it all on for you properly and I want to make like a TikTok and a reel. So if that isn't in this vlog, it'll be in the next one. Um, but yeah, I want to like try it all on and like make content out of it. So that'll be fun. I got some really cute dresses this time because I'm going to Broadway Con, by the way. They featured me as like a creator. It was so cute. I was like, sure, me? Okay. I was invited by Yes Broadway. It is July 8th, 9th, and 10th in New York City. So if you are going or you want to go, I will be there. So I got some cute dresses for that. Um, I've never been. My friend Francesca is coming with me one of the days because she's like a Broadway theater gal. Yeah, I think it'll be a lot of fun. I love Broadway. I'm not a connoisseur. I don't know like all of the actors and all of the history and things like that. I love watching it, but I'm always down for any con, a uh, uh, gathering, an event. I love stuff like that. That's gonna be a lot of fun. So yeah, if you wanna go and wanna like say hi, please do so. I have no idea how much the tickets are. I'm sure you could probably just buy one for one day. I'm not saying this in like a conceited way at all, but if you are gonna go because of me, um, play it safe, go Friday or Saturday, because I don't know if I'm gonna be exhausted by Sunday and like make it. Um, so we'll see. Why is my voice going? Hello? Okay, anyways, it is now 8.49. So we are going to see how long I like can chat for. That was like, what? What did I say? It was 29, 20 minutes I just talked for. I'm gonna get some work things done on my computer. If you're curious, like Alyssa, what does that mean? I don't know. I like the behind the scenes of YouTube business. It it really like um, intrigues me. I think it's interesting. So on my to-do list, we have, I have to sign a contract for a brand. I have to order something for a brand, like for the brand deal. Um, I want to edit like probably two TikToks real quick and get them ready to go. I have to make a kind of concept script for a brand and send that over to them for approval of like how I'll be incorporating it into my vlog. Um, and I like to have kind of like a rundown because sometimes brands will send like a few pages of like notes of what to say and then, and I like to condense that into like whatever they're paying for, 60 seconds, two minutes. You know what I mean? I like to like condense them so that I'm not sitting in front of the camera when I film the brand deal. Like, uh, I have to sort through five pages of things. So I like to, you know, pull information from there. It's kind of like my homework when I do a brand deal. And then I also have to record an ad for the podcast, which I don't know if I'm gonna get to today, but that's not due for, oh, another two days. <laughs> Actually, I should probably do that. I'm gonna do that today or tomorrow. And then I also have a real do for a brand <laughs> tomorrow. So I have to come up with concept, what clips I want to film and get that filmed, edited and sent in by tomorrow. So that's like the boring computer work that I do, signing contracts, coming up with concepts, picking items, things like that. I mean, I'm blessed, grateful and thankful that this is my job, but that's a lot of the stuff that I do on my computer and then obviously editing videos. Um, but it's a lot of just pulling things together, coming up with like calendar dates and things like that. So yeah, I'm gonna get that stuff done. I've got like an hour before we wanna leave. So let's see what I can do. All right, we're getting out a little late. It is 1038. I don't know what's happening to me. I'm having like a muscle spasm in my shoulder. If I like twist or move the wrong way, it's really killing me. But same, just put a cream on it. So we're gonna hope that that goes away. If not, then after the beach, we're gonna have to stop at the doctor because it's very painful. I don't know what happened. So weird. I was fine all morning and I maybe like stretched or cracked my shoulder the wrong way. It's like 
really hurting. But anyways, the show must go on. Bringing my book, my glasses case. I have a beach bag in the car, sunscreen. Um, I packed a little bag, Zane's holding it, of truly ice pops. And there's, um, what are these called? Ice packs in here. So I'll put one on my shoulder when we get there. And we're gonna stop and pick up some jelly sandwiches. Okay, that's the plan. Let's go. Sandwiches have been acquired. Quick stop at Ocean State Job Lot to see if they have a beach chair. <laughs> I never got one. We found our options. I wouldn't be mad at that blue striped one right there. Yeah. No. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna put a towel on it anyway. Oh, that's true. Found them. Okay. This one, though. No? Yeah. What about? Um, yeah, I just like that it's lower to the ground. Or maybe that one. That other blue striped one. And I like, but I like that that blue one has like a side pocket for like your phone and like a drink holder thing. Mm -hmm. Chair and towel. Check. Success. All right, let's go. <laughs> I'm not gonna shower until later because I'm gonna go to Zumba and I wanna like exfoliate my tan off and stuff. So I figured I'd just stay nasty and sweat at Zumba. I'm going through the photos because we took pictures today at the beach and I'm trying to fix my back. It still hurts. Not as bad as before, but it definitely still hurts. So I've got this massage thing. I'm gonna lay on it and hopefully it helps. Nothing is hitting the right spot. Bobby, first of all, I don't think you should lay on that. Sit in a chair. And then you can hold it and move it till it gets in the right spot. Okay, yeah, you're right. I'll sit. Oh. What did I do to myself, man? I don't know. Oh, this this is good though. Good. It's so annoying. All right, guys, I just got some work done on my computer. I am heading out to Zumba. I'm just wearing this sports bra from Marshalls, I think. It has Rika on it. I think that's how you pronounce that brand. Um, Fabletics leggings and my Zumba sneakers. My shoulder still does hurt a little bit. Um, it's a lot better than this morning, but I'm just gonna like, you know, put, try not to go too crazy in Zumba and hopefully I don't hurt myself even more. I'm gonna bring a sweater because afterwards we are going right to Zane's tennis match tonight. So that will be fun. Bringing my glasses case because we're treating my glasses right. And yeah. That's the dealio. It gets super hot in this gym location that I'm going to, so that's why I'm like, I'll just stick to the sports bra. I'm kind of looking like a hot mess too. I obviously need a shower. I know I included it a lot in my, I think it was my most recent vlog. Oh, two vlogs ago actually. So I probably won't bore you guys with it again today, but I do have to take a picture for the cover of something for Instagram. I want to post like a reel of Zumba, so I need like a cover. I don't have one, so I have to take that today. Okay. We're out of here. Let's go. Oh, and look who came. Hello, fresh. Very excited for that this week. Oh my God. Also, by the way, I forgot to tell you guys. I don't know if I you could tell on camera because it was kind of windy at the beach. Literally, I went to unzip the little thing on the side to put my phone in the pocket and it freaking broke. The zipper broke right off. So I'm debating because it was $45 this chair. I'm like, should I take it back and like get a new one? I don't know. The pouch still works. It just doesn't zip, which is annoying. <laughs> Zumba was oh so fun. Just changed really quick into a t-shirt. I'm really looking real rough today. Zane made dinner, so I just um, took my plate into the car while we drive to the tennis club. Got some air fried chicken wings, some frozen veggies, some ranch. Oof, so good. I walked into the apartment. It smelled amazing. So I'm very hungry and very excited, especially after working out. I always lose track of the score, so I'm keeping it on my phone. <laughs> I found this website. This helps me so much. Killed it. Usually you're supposed to stay until like everyone finishes. Or at least like you find out you win. Guess what I did this time. What? Check this out. You're gonna be so proud of me. What is this? <laughs> I <have to> score. <laughs> it's a scorekeeper? Yeah, you just tap it on each person's name. I didn't know his name, so I just put the town. Yeah. But you hold on, wait, restart it. Uh restart. Where's the reset rest scores? Yeah. So like if you would get one, I would just hit this. And then if he would go, I get that. And then eventually if they get it, That's then it goes so like that. That's so funny. 
It's so helpful. Because cool. I forget right away. As soon as I'm like, okay, it's 30, 15. And yeah. then I'll be like, shit, what was it? That's so funny. Yeah. So this is cool. Yeah, it helped me a lot. Nice. <laughs> so what was the score? It was... Oh, see, I didn't keep track of that. I just know you won two out of three. It was uh, six zero six one. Six one six one. Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh, six one six one. Okay, but but this helped me a lot. That's awesome. <laughs> I need a car walker. I do need a car walker. <laughs> Alrighty, we got some Love Island going in bed, and I air fried a sweet potato and put some syrup on it. Good night. Well, hello everyone. Happy Thursday. <laughs> This might be kind of confusing, but I filmed HelloFresh today and then with like the timing of like both mine and HelloFresh's schedule, it's going up in the next vlog. So the next vlog will be starting with a clip from today of me making HelloFresh, but it was delicious. It was like a pasta chicken recipe and it was really good. So that's what I did today. I got on Tanner. Um, I've been doing stuff on my computer, just little things around the apartment. And now we are going to get ready for a photo shoot, we're going to do a photo shoot with Monica. She asked Zane and I to model for her on the beach wearing white. It's gonna be gorgeous. So I wanted to get, you know, a nice bronze tan. I tried a new one. Tanologist, one hour express. I'll show you right now because I'm about to go in the bathroom to get ready. Here we are. The next vlog is gonna be really fun, by the way. Just saying. This is the tanner. Tanologist, one hour express. I put it on at 9 a.m. <laughs> And it is now 6.34. So it's definitely nice and dark. I was like, ooh, let me put on a one hour all day. That would be nice, right? And I already asked Monica if she cares if I like were to get it on her duvet cover because she's bringing that. And she was like, no, it's already stained with tanner. And I was like, perfect. So I'm gonna leave it on so it's nice and dark. I'm gonna take off this little bit of makeup that I put on before to film HelloFresh and then redo a fresh face of makeup and put some curls in this hair. Nothing crazy because it's gonna get beachy anyway, um, but I washed it last night. So it's kind of just like natural. I just slept on it and I had it in a bun for a little bit today. It actually looks kind of cute. Maybe I'll just put some waves in it. This is Monica's vision. So I'll ask her if she prefers a curling iron or like a beach waver and then we'll go from there but I'll do makeup first by the way I don't know if I ever give an update but my shoulder feels a lot better like thank goodness because I don't know what that was it was so painful um but now it feels like it's slightly bruised <laughs> from using the massager I think I used it a little bit too much a little bit too hard so now when I press on it it's a little, it's a little bruised up but it's not the same pain as yesterday I don't know what it was but thank god it's not there I will pay attention make sure it doesn't come back <laughs> Anyways, oh, I should do a TikTok transition. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, um, I'll see you guys when I'm ready. Um, hi, in Alyssa fashion, I kind of ran out of time for everything, so I don't even have time to finish my TikTok. We literally have to leave right now. Uh, here's my outfit. Lovely and blush boutique, Abercrombie top. She wants us to wear all white. And then I'm just wearing my, um, my sparkly Steve Maddens, but I, that she's gonna want us to go barefoot. I put some beach waver waves in my hair because I was like, what's quick and easy? I'm bringing my lipstick. I have to put on all my jewelry. Oh, this piece of fuzz. Um, and Zane went to the car, so we're gonna leave now. Put on the lipstick. I haven't done heavy makeup in a while. It feels nice. All right, we gotta go though. I gotta go. We gotta go. I'm gonna I'm gonna vlog some behind the scenes for you guys. Okay. Okay. Off we go. Look how gorgeous, especially with the bird poop. It's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I need a car walk. Now. I know. We said that. We should. We should go. Oh well, they're gonna be closed after we're done here, but going at like peak sunset. We're going to Robert Moses Beach. Reason number 1,055,000 of why I love Long Island. 15 minutes and we're here. Gorgeous. I'm actually very excited for this photo shoot. We planned it. I feel like it was like over a month ago. And of course, Zane and I are excited because pictures together are always fun. Thanks. Yeah. And we love working with Monica. We, we both work with her like individually. Like he does photos with her. I do photos with her. We do couple photos. She's just like She's just awesome. Mm, yeah, shout out Monica. Shout out Monica. She just knows what we want. She knows us really well. And it's nice. It's nice to have a photographer you're really comfortable with, you know? Anyways, I'm gonna put on my lipstick. Hair is giving messy beachy vibes. Yeah. It's fine. We use the beach waiver now. Yeah, yeah, it's literally called the beach waiver. There you go. I definitely rushed, but it's fine. Definitely gonna do lip gloss. That's the vibe today. Is she there already? Probably. Well, this really is the best time, huh? Golden hour. It's golden hour right now. It's gonna be gorgeous. These pictures are gonna be... So follow me on Instagram so you guys can see them. They probably won't be up yet, but soon. It's been a minute since we got professional pictures together. When was the last time we did together? I don't Gotta know. be good shoot. Gotta sure. be good. Yeah, we took like a few.
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're back from the shoot. It was so much fun, as expected. Very fun. And she like, you know, went through the photos really quickly on her camera and we looked at them there. Fire! I'm so excited! Oh yeah. We took a few solos too, so it's <clears> perfect. <throat> we are eating HelloFresh leftovers. I'm so hungry. I'm actually very glad that we <clears throat> saved this for right now. I don't want to take off my makeup. I feel like I just did it. I know, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I didn't realize it's 10.30 already. I know. Damn, this is in the spot. You don't mind your mac and Great cheese? Great call. Yeah, not like creamy and cheesy. Mm -hmm. yeah. I should make like a creamy mac and cheesy recipe. You should. I can do that. Definitely co-sign that. <laughs> you good? Can I go work? Yeah, you can go work. I didn't know if you were gonna like talk about Oh. I that's why you did this. I told him that the next vlog is gonna be exciting, but... Yeah, maybe you don't even... Keep it hype? Yeah. Is it bad juju to like hype it up so much? I didn't hype anything up. I just said, oh, the next vlog's gonna be fun. Mm. Look at me, you guys. I'm gonna freaking kill these roses already. Look at them wilting. And you're like, what? <laughs> Fresh water. I really feel like I just got ready and I barely vlogged and my makeup is all like nice. I mean, obviously it's like beachy kind of crappy now, but I feel like I just did it, but I used it. We took a bunch of photos, so it's fine. Um, but I just haven't gotten ready ready like this in a while, so I feel like, oh, I don't want to take it off and go to bed. I'm going to chat out on this HelloFresh. Tomorrow is Zumba in the morning and then I have a nail appointment with my friend Volante. We're going to go get our nails done. Look at them. They are very grown out. They actually lasted beautifully though. The design is all there. We're all good. You can barely really tell because it's nude. They lasted really well. And the place that we go to, I love because, well, we've only been once, but it's Sherry's in West Islip. It's nice because they have two chairs next to each other. So like the fact that like I booked two appointments, they're gonna seat us next to each other. We can actually talk. You know, when you go to get your nails done with your friend and you're like screaming from across the <laughs> nail salon. So I love that. That place has two chairs next to each other. I'm really giving major side part right now, but I kind of love everything about that. Get ready for the next vlog. It's going to be very, very fun. I'm really excited. Something fun is happening. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys. I'm using... Whoa. So what this cover-up is from... This lighting is not good. Okay, get it together. Oh.